morning. I'm at uh, a place called Hawkshead, come for a walk. So I've parked down there, I'll just show you where that car's coming out of. It's car park to Hawkshead. And here is the village. That's a school there that William Wordsworth went to. You're not really going to see me this morning on this because uh, I've only been up for about 40 minutes and I thought I'm going to jump in car and I'm going to go up to Walkshead. Uh, so we're staying about 20 minutes from here if that in a lovely little cottage. Anyway, the sun, the pub, live music, it's really good for that. They have some good bands on. What's on this week? Ross. So that's the sun. A little chippy. Oh, it's a medi morning, mate. Oh, yeah, morning. Yep. Videoing. All the rubbish. All the rubbish, that's it. Uh, yeah, yeah. So, what for? eh? What for? For YouTube. Oh, yeah. So, I've got a channel thing on YouTube. Oh, right. So, you go, you go around all the villages. Go around all the villages, ah. Uh, well, so not during midday when there's lots of folk around. Oh, no, no. You don't want tourists on it. They're, they're a nuisance. Oh, right. So, they're getting away. So, I thought, I'll walk around all said quickly while it's nice and quiet. So, you are you from here? I thought you were, yeah, I bought some, uh, I bought a stick from there, right. so you've got to go to there, it's one of the best outdoor shops, and downstairs is all men's stuff, uh, and they have fantastic clothing. Thank you very much. Not a problem, uh, and the local to area, it's a proper family, so you get loads and loads, I, w I didn't want to put him on because it's not nice, but yeah, you have some nice stuff in there. Uh, this place here, Ginny's Teapot. I don't want frequent it. It's vegan. Uh, they have some nice food. They do have some nice food. There we go. Poppy Red. Fantastic place for breakfast if ever you're in Oakshead. Pop into Poppy Red, you'll love it. And there, up on the hill, overlooking the village, is the Church of St. Michael's and All Angels. Oh, I was saying before I got rudely interrupted. It's a medieval village. Uh, it was set up by monks. Uh, so there you go. That's absolutely pathetic there. I won't even bother going in there about the other bits of here. This is old market hall. So all these have been bricked up, these arches. It's where market were, butchers and that. Oh my god. What disturbs peace? Bleeding cow. Uh, never mind. So that's market hall, the old market hall. And now they have like craft fairs and stuff like that on upstairs. Cheryl loves it in there because she's into all art and all that stuff. Take a walk up here. I don't know how sound's going to be on this because I'm not speaking loud. And I'm only doing it on my phone. I'm going to take a walk up here to St. Michael's. Let's mark it all. Where are you going? I was looking down into Oakshead. What a lovely, beautiful little village. So there we go. The parish church 
of St. of Oakshead, St. Michael's. You can tell I've only just got up, can't you? I don't know if you're going to be able to see that, but mountains over there. With clouds just bobbing along. Yeah, there's four pubs in the village. What size is it? That's not bad, is it? Honey pot. Honey pot do a lovely range of specialist foods. I can't really get too close, so I can go out this way to it. There are some really nice stuff in there. It's one of the lovely tea rooms in the village. And there's Flag Street. And that leads up an art at the village. I'm putting this on today because I just thought I need to get out. It's about 8.30 ish in that region. this way you can see it's medieval by art buildings that are built overhanging this was to save room and also tax evasion because you paid for land that the building were built on so they would put a little off shot on used to be a lovely tea shop and it closed it's now a private home and Tyson's cottage is just up this lane I bet you're all thinking where's governor well Cheryl's with Sid uh, and I thought well while she's sorting things out and reading having a breakfast I'll have a quick run out for an hour still got cobbled paths This is going to be one of them videos where it's windy, I can feel it here now, and I hate it, so before I even post it, I apologise. Fantastic pub, a fantastic food, Red Lion. Just around the corner, you've got Ivy Cottage Guest House. It's closed at the moment, they're doing it up. We've stayed there many a time. But, do you know something? If you want somewhere to stay, somewhere to stay in Oakshead, Holly Lodge. It's lovely. Find this place. Don't stay there. This is an absolutely gorgeous little guest house and Darren owns it
those the best bed and breakfast. So Darren used to warn this one. Well, he used to uh, run it. Ivy Cottage, which is going to be done up. That's what they're on with at the moment. That's old police house. No longer in use, that's a uh, thing now. Morning, mate. Morning. That's a, uh, like a holiday let now. As I said, 15th century coaching in uh, Red Lion. This is where Beatrix Potter's uh, husband, where she met her, well she didn't meet him here, but this is where he actually worked. It's all about Beatrix Potter up this end. National Trust property. That's a Beatrix Potter place. I can't show you the other side because there's a bloody vampire there. Bend or bump. Another National Trust property. Just uh, rented our house now. Queen's Head, another pub. I tell you, they were four in, in the village. So you got Sun, you got Queen's Head, you've got Red Lion, and there's one just around this corner. Ed used to run that one, but he's now give it up. So remember I was saying about Beatrix Potter. That's a nice little guest house as well. Uh, rent holiday rent, brown cow. I'm gonna say so much about that. I don't like yellow. It's all about cats. What's all that about? Anyway, Oak said the relish company. So Oak said relish company. That building there is where Beatrix Potter's. Husband had his solicitors 